another beautiful yet scorching day. We prepared a little more this morning, I'd say. A lot more sunscreen. Definitely more deodorant. <laughs> Alright, so these are the smoked turkey and scrambled egg breakfast melts. We'll see how they are. Much better on the belly than those breakfast gravy smothered tachos. So it's not weighing me down. Looking forward to take on the day. Heading into Municiburg. Audrey hasn't seen any of this yet. So of course I'm gonna bug her and point out all the detail to her. So we'll see you guys in a second. Here is the bakery in Municiburg. Um, this whole line is for this stand. So I don't know if they're getting the Italian salmon for breakfast or if it's all for the num num cookies, but we'll find out. 115 minute wait for the Tower of Terror, guys. It is a busy Memorial weekend. Let's uh, see how long Rock and Roller Coaster is. We actually have a fast pass for Rock and Roller Coaster tonight. Um, around 7-ish, I believe. I'll have to double check, but uh, we're just walking around, seeing what's going on at the moment in between uh, rides and fast passes. Wow. 115 minutes. It's hard to tell on the analog. The rock and roller coaster as well. So, uh, let's check out the new uh, Lightning McQueen Racing Academy. Look at all this. Cruz Ramirez. I only work with the best, and that means you. Thank you, Cruz. Off to the races with Piston Cup winner, Lightning McQueen. Seven time Piston Cup winner. And Lightning isn't the only Piston Cup winner. Of course, I'm talking about Cruz Ramirez. All right, we just wrapped up with uh, Lightning McQueen Racing Academy. Now we're getting out of the way of the crowd in front of the uh, Rock and Roller Coaster. I just have to say, that was a pretty good attraction, at least for the, the space that they have. They make good use of it. You know, it'll definitely decongest the streets and other rides a little bit, but overall, it's a really cool event. So I invested in one of these fans. Best decision I've ever made, ever. 10 out of 10 would recommend, recommend. and uh, probably I'll buy another one when I forget to bring this on my next trip. Alright everybody, I am here with my Uber Mark right here. Mark, Mark you the have the best theme memorial Uber I've ever seen and guys look at this. He's got Love, Waters Teas, Yoohoo, Oh my gosh, Dum Dums, Fruit Snacks, Scooby Snacks, Rice Krispies. <laughs> Look at that, tissues. Love it. What type of phone do you have? He has a charger. For them all. Barf, Bring every phone bags, you have. Can't handle yourself, wipes. <laughs> this is incredible, Mark. Cheers to Mark, everybody. Everybody. <laughs>
Yes, I love it. Guys, don't don't be fooled by Mark. He's a 30-year baker from the Grand Floridian and more. I mean, this is this is incredible. He's, doing. he's telling me some awesome stories. Y'all, Mark from Uber in Orlando, <laughs> off the chain. <laughs> All right, so when I say I just had the best Uber ride in my life, I'm not kidding. He, he gave us, he gave us presents. presents, waters. I mean, you guys are already, if you've seen the vlog and you're watching it, you already seen what else he offered for free. And, He's you know, sweetheart. people are going to say, oh, he wants tips that. No, he was incredible. The conversation was incredible. He was a baker. Bye, Take it easy, Mark. There he was he a baker at the Grand Floridian for 30 years. Um, he worked on the gingerbread house on the holidays here and there. Um, he did events mostly, but he was around the block for a while. And, and incredible stories, incredible Uber, incredible customer service. I know you can't ask for Mark, but if you get Mark, give him five stars and tip him like crazy. This man's incredible. Here for our Star Tours Fast Pass. Star Tours is proud to introduce Classic. the Star Speeder 1000, the most sophisticated and luxurious space liner in its class. While other space liners pack you in like a herd of pontos, Star Tours is proud to So long, Hollywood Studios. You've been wonderful to us. We will see you next time. It is so beautiful around Hollywood Studios. I know the sky is kind of setting us up for it, but just the, the trees, everything, minus the construction walls, nonetheless. I love it.